my nose Came in front of the bottom of my own road Yesterday I bought myself my own rolls It had diamonds in the bezel What up peeps? I'm back with another video And this is how to customize Hirachis And these are the adult versions So basically what the customer wanted was the top to be all blue so you're gonna need some masking tape and you're gonna want to tape the bottom of the sole the bottom soles and leave the top exposed to your paint and you're gonna want to buy some Angela's blue paint or whatever paint and I'll leave that link in the description you can get a discount for that and you're gonna need a razor or a cutting knife or whatever something that's sharp and you can also get that paintbrush at Angela's Dot com. I'll leave that link in the description as well. So basically, I already have already did one coat. That's I did that before the video even started, and then I just started applying more coats to it. I know currently the shoe is looking pretty messy, but when you finish, it's gonna look decent trust me and the reason why I am only painting the leather is because I am waiting for the Angela's GAC 900 and that's to put on the fabric because if you paint on the fabric it's gonna harden even with shoelaces that's what I used to do but now I started you know becoming more professional and you know knowing things what to do and what not to do so basically you're gonna have to order that as well and I believe that is ten dollars as well but if you click the link in the description description you get a discount so anytime you use the link that I provide you get a discount I don't know how much I think it was what 20% or 10% but yeah I know the shoe is looking messy but that's why I masked the shoe um, so because I'm not good at you know um, using a uh, paintbrush I'm only good at airbrushing it's the best but for this shoe I had to use my paintbrush just so I don't spray over the fabric Okay, this is the, the, this is like the fourth, no, this is the third coat. Yeah, this is the third coat, and sorry, I had to adjust my camera because I had no clue that my camera angle was, you know, showing half the shoe. But this is the third coat, and I'm just going to keep going over what I painted, which is the leather. You can also paint the... What, can I, what do you call it? It's a, it's a rubber material. You can paint over that, as you can see right there. And then once you finish, you're going to apply Krylon Crystal. No, you know what? For this one, you're going to have to apply um, Angela's um, acrylic finisher because, you know, it does good on shoes like this. But like Air Forces, use Krylon because it gives you that factory matte finish and not being so glossy because I know Angela's paint is pretty glossy. Oh yeah, and while you're at it, smash that like button for me if this video helped you out. If it didn't, I'm sorry. I will have more videos that might appeal to you and you know, you might understand it. Basically, I'm finished. You don't have to mind the messy parts that you got because you're gonna finish that off with the GC GAC 900, and that is the matte finisher. And you do not need to dull the paint because I believe this look is perfect even after applying the matte finisher. But the reason why I didn't have I didn't do the fabric is because I'm waiting on the package to come in and back. But anyways, give that this video a thumbs up, and I see y'all again on another video. Go kill it, I got broad jack, get it. I got car jack, shit. It's how it is. Did it all for a ticket. I'm the 